More record-breaking heat today. It'll be a different story this weekend. John, we were just talking. I'm, I just kind of wonder, does the temperature itself have any impact on these brush fires? Many facets and many things contribute to this, but it's the fuel. There's so much fuel. And then again, that spark from a train. Notice that fire raced right up the hill. Yeah. And then it kind of burned itself out, but still very scary. And still, we are dealing with hot and dry conditions until... Tomorrow. I mean, there's going to be an abrupt change tomorrow. The view overhead for you on two looks like summer. Feels good, too, in the city. And if you're going out tonight, have fun. I mean, it's going to stay mild. Sunny in 84 right now. Wind out of the south southeast at 15 miles an hour. Wowee. It was 84 on Wednesday. Remember that cool 84? Two in a row at 90 and 91. Look at the big drop, though, Saturday into Sunday. But just look at that, 90 and 91. That's been a long time. Let's see when's the last time we had consecutive 90s in April. Way back in 2002, we were having a heat wave. No heat wave this time. We're going to see an abrupt change. In fact, look at the morning lows. Mid-50s, 58 in the city. Uh, you know, yesterday, we never got below 70 at all. Tomorrow afternoon, mid-60s. Cooler still out on the island, a little bit more typical for April. What's going on right now? Some high clouds creeping in. That beautiful sunset in the city will be replaced by more clouds over the weekend. Through the mid-Atlantic, some showers, and this is the signature we're going to see. You're going to see things break up, and we'll have those little pockets where you won't see anything. You can see that right here. So as we put the future cast to work, it is not going to be a washout. Going out late tonight, maybe a sprinkle here and there through Nassau and Suffolk. And then tomorrow morning, stray shower. Won't see a lot of coverage. See this pinwheel and see how we miss a lot of that. Early afternoon, scattered showers. Every now and then a pocket of heavier rain. Not a lot. It will be cooler. There will be clouds. There will be the threat of showers. Not that much coverage. And then Sunday, much of the day is dry. But late Sunday into Monday, this is what we're talking about. Likely more coverage and a little bit more in the way of uh, heavy rain. So for early flights or back to work and school Monday morning, the European is a little bit more aggressive than some of the other models. And even that's having a hard time cranking out more than half an inch. And we need to make up this big deficit. So we'll leave showers in the mix passing this weekend. Cooler next week. So we'll help a lot as far as fire conditions around the area. All right, John. Thanks very much.